Yeah, hello guys, what's up? Welcome to Hazard's Tavern again. Today we're gonna play a pretty fast-paced deck called Aggro Druid or Zerg Druid. I'm sure you've seen a lot of these decks um, currently on Hearthstone's ladder. And this is actually a really good deck to, to ladder, to grind, and to get to rank 5 for example, or even to Legend. So let's give it a shot. I'm actually playing a few uh, tech cards here to counter, for example, Midrange Paladin or um, Morlock Paladin and Pirate Warriors as well, because they're pretty popular at the beginning of the season. So it's good to have some Glocka Crawlers. Alright, there's Priest. Alright, pretty cool. So that was fast. Sometimes you can win without fighting, you know. Ancient Eastern philosophy. All right. Let's go again. So basically, all you want to do is swarm the board with some cheap minions and buff them up. Um, basically, rush your opponent down. All right. So, this is Shaman. He's got some AoE tools. Um, he's probably not playing pirates. You wanna keep the fledgling, because he's really OP if you can play it like turn two or one. We're not starting soon. It's not that easy, but we got Innovate, just to pull Fledgling turn one. All right, here it is. You can actually counter that with a Totem. Hmm. We could actually play Raven and buff it right away with uh, Mark. I don't know. Or play Fledging uh, right away and just spray. I think this is the safer play. We can play Fledging next turn. Let's go like this. Alright, another Fledging. Man, this is harsh. Alright, so we're going like this. And next turn we're gonna play Fledgling. And next three we're gonna play another Fledgling. Oh, interesting. So this is a token or evolve shaman. Most likely. So we just want to, you know, control the board a little bit. Get rid of one minion. You can play Flame Tongue right now and just destroy our board. Yeah, exactly. All right. So he's playing Pirates. It's fine, it's fine. Maybe we can control that. We've got, we, we've got two tones mm, to make it easier against uh, aggro decks. It's still possible to win. Okay. He actually can have some uh, more works in this deck, so we're gonna, we're gonna save that card and play this buddy.
this mana tide is strong here. Oh wow. All right, just to use mana efficiently, we're gonna buff our minions here, kill the totem, and leave it like this. He's at six mana, he's got a lot of things on his hand, so it's most likely lost. But this is how it works, it's like you know. It's a pretty fast deck, pretty coin flipping deck, I'd say. If you don't get control early, you're really struggling late game. Now let's make sure he's not getting more cards. And leave it like this. Well, we still have some... Um, we still have Swipe, we still have uh, Taunt, we have uh, Living Mana, for example, which is gonna be good here. So it is possible. It is possible. Alright. Oh, that's a lot of minions, man. The bloodlust is just gonna wipe us out. Yeah, easily. <laughs> All right, so this is the this is the problem with uh, Tolkien Shaman, but it's fine. Let's have a look at the next match. So basically, if you really hate, for example, Quest Rogue, or you're struggling against, I don't know, some other OP decks, uh, you're gonna choose Zerg Druid. On one hand, it's good because it's fast and you can win quickly, but you can just lose as quickly as, as that. Um, it's pretty coin flipping, you know. If you can't control uh, the game early on, you will really struggle to get back control uh, in the mid game or late game. Late game, well, if you got to late game, you probably lost. Alright, so it's another priest. Oh man. I'm getting patches, so we gotta get rid of that. We don't need creeper as well. It's not a quick deck. Well, this actually we could save that, you know, but we need some early drops. Let's mulligan it. Oh, okay. Fledgling. Let's go like this.
So he probably has some tools to, you know, swipe our minions. So we're gonna build a strong board. And buff them up with Power of the Wild. Mm -hmm. Silence Priest. Alright. Not surprising at all. Poisonous will be strong here. Alright, so next turn, hopefully, we could go for Mark and Power of the Wild. Ah, damn it. Okay. Oh, strong. All right, so, well, let's go for this guy. Oh, man. This is cool. Are we going to just buff him like this? Clear this guy because he can be really annoying. And go fast. Next turn is turn 5. We could go for Savage Roar and Mark for some nasty damage. Uh, yeah. Obviously. So we can go for a Fledgling. It's fine as well. Okay, so this turn he might be, for example, he might buff his minion. I'll just play some taunts. Not really, alright, so see he's going like this and this is GG for us. Yeah, so this one went really slowly for him. Boom! Oh man, my feel this is disgusting. Disgusting, man. Yeah, so basically it goes like this. You either win really fast, you gain control, or basically opponent kills your minions on the board and you lose. But in general, it's pretty fast deck. As you see, we played just you know a few minutes, and we played two games basically because the first one was not mm, much of a game. And so, as you can see, um, it's really good to grind. Uh, you can play like I don't know twenty games in one hour, for example, easily. Um, and the win rate is around. 55 60 percent ish so it's not bad either so i'm you know i hope you liked it guys try it out mm, i'm sure you're gonna enjoy it and you're gonna grind your for example uh, golden Malf malfurion pretty fast so leave leave up some comments like the video and see you next time cheers